Okay, my last story on AAOF.us, I did a story called Early Florida, starting back 15,000 years ago, when people used to take something like this, a big stick, they called it a spear, they would sharpen it with a rock, and then they would thrust that into something like a woolly mammoth. It didn't work all that well, but it did work. It w took the mammoth about three days to die. Then they learned how they could take the rock that they were sharpening the stick with and make points, stuff like this to help out and taking down the animals. They would put this on the end of a spear like this and then they would throw it at the animal. After a while they found out they were breaking off. Then they started using this, a detachable spearhead. They would hook it onto the spear. They could thrust it into the animal. When they pulled out, this would come off. They could reload and thrust again. Then they t found out that they could use something called the atlatl. We, we talked about the atlatl and everybody asked what it is. It's no more than a stick like this with a handle and a little tooth in the end to use to propel it forward. I'm going to do that for you right now. What you do is take your big atlatl dart, load it like this, aim it where you're going to throw it, and then launch it forward like this. Now, if you do that right, it can be thrown up to 854 feet. That's the longest atlatl ever thrown. After the atlatl, the bow and arrow was invented about 4,000 years ago. We talked about that. This is just a standard longbow. You take it, load your arrow, pull back, let it go, and you can kill animals much easier. But that's how the, um, the weapons went from 15,000 years ago to right now.